Hey, what is going on guys? This is Ben here and today I'm bringing you a little bit interesting of a Boom Beach video. I'm not doing any attacks, I'm not doing any of that, so this is going to be a little bit different. It's going to be called Boom Beach Races. Uh, we're going to see which troop is the fastest. Uh, of course, you're probably thinking, of course it's the Warriors, but I don't know. You never know because with the new addition of the Critters, we don't really, it doesn't say like their movement speed at all because if, if you look at any of the troops, you can see it either says like movement speed slow, moderate, or fast. It doesn't exactly say how fast they move through the tiles. So this is going to be interesting. I kind of made a little bracket here as you guys can see if you can follow that or not. But I, I put troops that I thought would be cool racing against each other. So first up we have the Warriors with the buy because they're probably the fan favorite. Um, but before we get started, let me know who you guys will think will win this race. Uh, we are considering the, critic, uh, the critter a troop as well because they... You can flare it and everything like that. So, yeah, first up we have the Warriors go, uh, receiving a buy. Then we have the Riflemen versus the Grenadiers. That one's going to be interesting. Then we have the Scorchers versus the Tanks because you got to put the two, like, cars or things with wheels get versus each other. And then we have the Heavy Zooka going up against it because they work well together with that Heavy Zooka. So we got to see, we, we kind of know which one's faster, but put them together. And then we have the Critics, Critters versus the Medics. So... The Warriors, of course, have the buy first, and then next up we have the Riflemen versus the Grenadiers. So, got them all trained up, got like the Noah's Ark composition trained up, and I was really looking at the Dr. Terra map, and I was like, dang, this is a wide open thing for a race. So what we're going to do is we're going to start at these supplies here, and we're going to race over, follow this straight line to the bunker. Um, I'm actually going to flare past a little bit the bunker, but the bunker is just the finish line. So whoever gets there to the finish line first wins. Uh, because you know how some troops have longer ranges and whatnot, so they might stop before the bunker to try and kill it or whatnot. So yeah, we're going to flare past the bunker. Always going to take out the boom cannon just in case some of my troops get in there, but let's get right into it. So what I have to do is destroy the boom cannon every time. Throw the flare on that, and then throw down a bunch of smokes. So the troops do not start attacking my little bunker there. Actually, we need to re reposition here. Get them flared up to the start and ready, set, go. So we got the flare going and they're off to the races. The Grenadiers have a little bit of a disadvantage, but will they catch up? They're like literally so close. Overtake that rifle. We come on, Grenadiers. Oh, is it a close arms race? Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Oh, I don't know. That was too close to call. We're going to have to go to instant replay right there. Let, let's check it out. I think, no, I think that we'll just consider that one a tie. That one was so close. Maybe the rifleman got a little bit of a gun in there. Uh, who really knows, but it, it was a little bit unfair because the rifleman did have a little bit of a head start. So we'll just call that one a tie. That one was really close. Oh my goodness. So, my boys, the rifleman are hanging in, are like hanging in there, but I for sure thought the grenadiers would be way faster. I guess not. So let's do that again. So well, we gotta take out the boom cannon. Round two. They're probably a little tired. The fatigue is setting in. Drop as many of the smokes as we can and then we'll flare right up here and then drop the two right next to each other. All right. Grenadier is going a little bit ahead this time. So go, 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 go. Actually, that was a perfect start actually. So. This Grenadier down here is like, oh, he's like going fast. We gotta stay in line with this. That's the finish line right there. And this time the Grenadiers for sure. No chance. Grenadiers for sure pulled that one out. So they are the winners. They're gonna be moving on. Man, that first race though was definitely very, very, very close. So next up we have the Scorchers versus the Tanks. This is the one that everyone's been waiting for to see who is the better tank. Because they're both technically tanks, kind of. Um, but let's drop all the smokes. All right, and then we're gonna drop the scorcher and the tank. We have 18 GBE left. We'll flare right up to here, and this one's gonna be interesting. All right, ready? Three, two, one, go, 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 go! Oh man, that scorcher is blowing those tanks out of the water. Oh my goodness! Tank's too slow. Let's go, Scorcher. And then the finish line will be right here. And, um, yeah. Easily. Easily, Scorcher has won that one. Oh, my goodness. Blew those tanks. Ah, they just ate that dust right there. 
So th there you go. Um, if you ever knew which one was faster, definitely the Scorchers. Next up, we have the Heavies versus the Zookas. Um, pretty sure we know who's going to win this one, but since we know the Heavies are a little bit faster from the beginning, because Heavy Zuki, you know the Heavies are always in the front, the Zookas are in the back. So we're going to give the Zookas a little bit of a head start on this one, to be honest. But I forgot to take out that, so we're going to do that. Drop these smokes all up in here. Alright, Zookas. We'll give you, you'll give you, we'll give you a two second head start. So, go. And then we'll drop the heavies now. Zookas got the head start, let's see how it goes. Oh my goodness. Heavies are going to overtake them eventually, but the finish line is right here. Keep reflaring past that. Finish line. Oh, this is a lot closer than I thought. I thought for sure the heavies would blow them out of the water. Oh my goodness, and it's by a gun. The heavies beat the Zookas by a gun right there. So, you can see the heavies are fast, but with the little head start, the Zookas almost won that one. But, it was interesting. The heavies only won by their machine gun, so that was a good race. Last to go in the first round, we have the Critters versus the Medics. Um, pretty sure the Critters are going to get this one because Medics just kind of stand still. There's, you don't really, you're not really able to flare them, because the medics is really chill there. But there we go. We're gonna start it out. Critters are already going to that building, but we're ready. Go 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 go. Maybe if we like hurt one of the critters, gotta gotta lead our shots here. Oh, can't hit them. Yeah, the, <laughs> the critters just blew them out of the water. Yeah, the medics are just slow. Uh, maybe we race back to the boat. Go go go. Just kidding. But yeah. We, we, we pretty much saw that one, the critters, but I didn't. I, I'm just really curious to see how the critters will fare against the warriors if we get to that. But yeah, definitely critters move on for that one. So the first after the first round, we have the warriors moving on with another buy. Then we have the grenadiers versus scorchers. That should be a good one. Then we have heavies versus the critters. I think we're gonna have to give the heavies a little bit of a head start. But so first up, grenadiers versus the scorchers. This is to take on the warriors. So. Let's, let's clear up our little map. They already got the boom cannon out. Grenadiers and Scorchers. Let's see. I'm actually curious to see because they're both pretty fast. Flare here. Grenadiers out. Scorchers out. And alright. Three. Two. One. Go, 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 go. Grenadiers getting out to an early lead. Got the lead man going. Got Jamie from Mythbusters. Oh my god. The Grenadiers are pulling it out. And the finish line is right here. And Grenadiers moving on. I actually thought the Scorchers were going to win that one. Because they're pretty fast. I didn't realize how fast the Grenadiers actually were because I'm surprised they're not falling over because they're freaking drunk. But alright, so surprisingly, Grenadiers won that one. On foot. They beat, they beat a car, guys. Alright, for the last round, for the last two in round number two, we got the Critters versus the Heavies. We know the Critters are probably a little bit faster, so we're going to give the Heavies a little bit of a head start, kind of like we gave the Zookas. So here we go, we're gonna flare here, drop those smokes all around there, and let's see, critters and the heavies. So there we go, let's flare it onto there, right there. Actually, I have to drop the critters late, so I think for the for the head start, we're gonna drop the heavies, flare them, and then drop the critters, because that, that'll be a kind of like a fair thing, because the critters have to deploy and then explode open. Yeah, that'll be fair, so here we go. We're going to take out the boom cannon again. Drop all the smokes. Heavies. And flare out. Critters, go. So let's see. This is going to be interesting. Heavies have a, quite a bit of a head start. I don't know what the critters are doing now. Oh, man, dude. The heavies got a huge head start there. So we'll just drop the... Oh, it's going to be close. Oh. The critters got that one. The heavies almost won that one and pulled it out. Surprisingly, the critters caught up. They got some good catch-up speed there. So that's going to wrap it up for round two. So we have, let's see here, we have the critters moving on. We have the warriors versus the grenadiers. And then critters are going to get the buy for the third round. And then we have the winner of the critter, or the warriors versus the grenadiers facing the critters. So this is going to be interesting. Warriors and Grenadiers. I think the Warriors are definitely going to be faster, so we'll give the... We'll maybe give the Grenadiers a little bit of a head start. Not much, because they're still pretty fast. For drunk people, for sure. So we're going to take out that. Dropped too many smokes than we really needed. Alright. 
player there. Warriors getting there. And... Crap, I forgot to do a head start. We'll see how bad it is. Ready? Go, 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 go. Yeah, the Warriors, no contestion, are just going to win that one easily. There's the finish line. Even with the head start, I would have given them. I think the Warriors had some good catch-up speed, but... It's, fa it's safe to say that Grenadiers are even slower. Um, least favorite troops, so we'll, 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 we won't do a redo. <laughs> so our final matchup, we have the Warriors versus the Critters. Taking bets right now, who do you think's going to win? Um, it's going to be pretty close. But seeing those Critters, man, catch up to those... Uh, those heavies on that last run, that's, ah, uh, it's, it's man versus machine. Who will win? Man versus machine. The critters or the warriors. They're both freaking fast. Say that. Oh, no head starts. We're doing this legit way. So we're going to drop all the smokes we can. Drop the critters. Drop the warriors. Flare right here. See if they're close enough together. Yep, they're close enough together. They're all they're going to that box. That's perfect. They're going to that box. All right, drop another smoke. All right, three, two, main event. Ready? Place your bets now. Done. Go. All right. So off to the. Oh my goodness! Machine is taking the lead. Machine. The critters are winning, and they're the finish line. No chance. Those little things are freaking fast, man, dude. Shock them. Oh my god. Those little bugs are fast. I was actually expecting the Warriors to win that one. Well, now we know the Critters are victorious. They are the fastest troop in Boom Beach. I honestly thought the Warriors, well, they're the fastest machine in Boom Beach. The fastest man is definitely the Warriors, but that was a little bit interesting. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like if you did. I know it was a little bit random of a video. I don't know. I just saw the Dr. Terror wide open that I was like, hey, why not? Should be interesting. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to like if you did. And don't forget to subscribe for more Boom Beach videos if you have not already. And hope you guys have a wonderful day or night. And I'll see you guys later. Critters OP, man.